Oh hey, welcome back to the life of a bus converter. It's just another day. This movie is all about getting shade. We're putting up Reflectix panels that are removable, putting up a sun sail, and finally, I'm gonna be tinting, not just tinting, fully blacking out the windows. They're gonna be blocked out by wall paneling and stuff like that. You guys know what I'm talking about. Let's just get to it. We're gonna cover up some of these windows so we stop getting baked, like baked potatoes in here. My name is Jaden, and I'm a new recruit to this, this plan. I am the nephew of Juice Fox and Bow Bow. Welcome, Jaden. We're vlogging. We are vlogging. vlogging. All right, Jade, so we're gonna do three windows at a time. Hold on, yep. And put it right up next to that other piece of reflectance. Yeah, perfect. I'm gonna do 93 inches. We'll do 35. Be good. So 93 by 35. And walk. I got 93 right in front of me. So I'm gonna hold this right here. Oh, pretty good. Like it's really good. Perfect. So you can make a straight cut. And you're gonna make this cut again. You're doing a great job. I've got these 3M hanging Velcro strips. Looks sticky. These white ones are cheaper, so I'm gonna use those. My name behind the scenes is Cameraman Joe. Two that looks standing. really sticky. Oh my gosh, can you do it? Just like that. Yes! Mm. We still have that and tape there. on it. It's done. Yeah. So now, when it's like super sunny in here, I can put these Reflectix panels on. But of course, there's a thunderstorm coming. Oh, thanks, Jaden. Yes, very nice. Thank you, Jaden, for your help putting up those Reflectix panels. They look great. Jaden's left to go watch Jurassic Park 3. And my sun sail just got here in the mail. And I'm gonna try and get it up before this thunderstorm comes. All right, I haven't been filming. I've been trying to set up this sun sail. I was trying to beat the thunderstorm. It just came too soon. Luckily, we have a lightning alarm on the golf course behind us. I'm not afraid of spiders or snakes or dust. I'm not afraid of many things. But lightning, scary. Lightning and horses. Horses are just so scary. Huge, huge creatures could just club you in your head. But I'm not about to stand on top of this metal school bus in the middle of a thunderstorm. As much as I really want to keep working, if there was no lightning and thunder, I would probably do that. All right, so here's my plan. I want a really quick, easy disconnect off these things. So I got these giant, ridiculous carabiners. All right, so I got that right there. This right here. I'm using a carabiner, a turnbuckle, another carabiner, and this um, mounting bracket. Now I'm gonna be estimating about a 20 degree slant so that water runs off well, and I'll be using this turnbuckle to create my tension. The last thing I wanna mention is that I am going to be going into two bricks. Definitely do your own research about this. In a serious wind, this could pull a brick or two out of the wall, which would be a really expensive repair. I'm definitely gonna be taking this sun sail down um, when storms are rolling through. In case you don't already know this, in order to drill into masonry like concrete or brick you need a hammer drill 3 16th tap con screws the appropriate drill bit size which is 532 okay got my holes marked now you want to drill your hole a half inch longer than your screw so i'm going to put a piece of tape and that's where i'm going to stop drilling need a little bit more length in my hardware somewhere. I need like just slightly longer carabiners or something because if I'm at the edge of my turnbuckle it'll be really hard to take down. So I swapped this off for a little bit longer of a setup. I've got a larger turnbuckle with a hook and an extra piece of chain and then when we want to take it off we're just going to turn this all the way until one falls off and then we'll be able to unclip there and unclip there. Get it down. So that's all done. I think it looks amazing. From the roof, bam, look at that. This thing is great. I'll put a link to the one that I actually bought in the description of the video. It's really cheap, it was like $30. And I'll link to all the hardware that I used also. Look at that big boy. He gonna run away. Oh, he's so chubby. Let's give him a kiss. You gonna kiss him? 
Oh, turn into a pretty princess. Ah. Here's how you can black out your windows if you're gonna keep them and panel over them, but you don't want anybody to see what's on the inside, which for us is going to be pieces of insulation. Step one, clean your window. Step two, clean it again. Like a dusty thing. Okay. Well, obviously we know how to clean a window. It's as hard as spraying some stuff and wiping it. Justin, come on, you can do better than that. We all know you can, and this is a yo-yo. A step of four, a measure your window. And with our clothes ask you, about me and you, we take our time making. That was step five. This is step six. Lightly dampen with a spray bottle, 32 ounces of water, six drops of dish soap. Now I dampen this. Now we line it up. And we spray this again. Come out here and check for bubbles. Bubbles. Oh god, the thunder's starting. So this is what it looks like outside. Yeah. What it looks like without tint. Honestly, there's no bubbles. It looks great. It looks great, guys. Just take my word for it. It looks great. Oh, man. How are we going to get back in? Bye, Justin. Bye. Oh, yeah. Look at this one's done. Oh, it's awesome. I love it. Let's give him some chocolate. Ah. Uh, mm. Last remaining question for this window film stuff is, is it going to last? Besides that, it's a great product. It's easy to apply. Um, it's really easy to get those bubbles out. I think it looks great. Yo, give me a my friends. We have a lot more to do, obviously. But there it is. They're gonna wipe the chocolate off your face. Now the girls on YouTube are gonna see you. Oh shoot! Wait, how many people are in the security line? Five. Five. Go Charleston. It's five people. They made me take my shoes off, so I'm just leaving them off, and Jaden's doing it too in solidarity. You gotta, you gotta take your freedoms where you can get them. Oh come on, man! You gotta roll with me. He doesn't believe in the cause like I do. This light is so pretty on you. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Bye. Bye, Jaden. Give Lucy a big smooch for Nomi's. A wet one. Yeah. There's probably a gorgeous montage to watch. The future is all in our heads All the Muslims are dancing on old Hancock Street And I'm listening for your footsteps instead And oh, oh my mon me All the ancient roads lead to your bed But don't It goes on.